All living organisms are composed of a variety of elements. Carbon, nitrogen, oxygen and hydrogen comprise the main elements of all organisms, with the ratio of these elements differing between organisms. To understand the role of nematodes in nitrogen cycling, we compare the carbon to nitrogen ratios of bacterial feeding nematodes and their prey, the bacteria. With bacterial feeding nematodes, carbon and nitrogen are present in the cells of the nematode at a ratio of six carbon to one nitrogen. The bacteria they consume consist of a narrower carbon to nitrogen ratio with a ratio of four carbon to every one nitrogen. This means that as the bacterial feeding nematodes consume their bacterial prey, they ingest more nitrogen per unit of carbon than they need. For example, if this nematode consumes three bacteria, it obtains 12 carbon units from its bacterial food. It also gets three units of nitrogen, which is more nitrogen than it needs. As a result, the excess nitrogen is excreted from the nematode into the surrounding soil environment in a form that is directly available for uptake by plant roots and other soil microorganisms. Of course, there are more than 12 carbon atoms and three nitrogen atoms in three bacteria, but it's the ratio that's important in this instance. This difference in the carbon to nitrogen ratios allows for nutrient release into the soil environment.